You know, not everyone is born hating a certain kind of person. It takes society telling them that. And slowly but surely, society is beginning to teach us that um, trans people are okay. We're not comedic relief, we're not scary, we're not men in dresses, we're people. I've fallen so many times down a hole, and now not only have I pulled myself up out of that hole, I have filled it with soil, and it is closed, and there is no way I'm ever falling in that hole ever again. I won't allow it. Somehow I knew that I could do something. I've struggled and hated myself, and uh, felt hopeless for so long, but there was always something in the back of my head saying, nope, keep going, keep going, keep going. If you just stick out for a little bit longer, things will get better and you will be able to make changes because you're a bad bitch. Queen Elizabeth I was a very, very inspiring figure growing up because she lived in a time when men had all the power. And it wasn't like today where men have power. Back then, men had all the power, like all the power. Women were considered nothing. Like, forget race, forget all of that. It was just, if you were a woman, goodbye. She somehow had this unique personality in which she said, no, I'm worth more than that. I don't need to have a man. I don't need to uh, get married or have kids. This is my throne. I'm keeping it. I need to stay in power because this country needs a woman in charge. And she resisted that her entire life and she had a great reign, she was great for the country and I love her.